we're going to be looking at the predator-prey simulation. If you are at SHS Galbraith, underneath the science simulations, we're going to be looking at code as built-in processing. So you can either go down to the bottom and copy all of that code, or you can go to this Google Doc version in order to get the code in the first place. I'm just going to grab this. So I'm going to select it all and copy it. And then if you have a processing program on your computer or tablet or iPad, you can use that or you can use this open processing. So if I go to open processing, this looks different than the old version. This is where I'm going to place my code. So notice this is highlighted. I'm going to select all of this and paste in the code that I had before. So here's this giant thing of code. There's one more setting we have to change. Over here where the dots are, I need to click on this and make sure I have processing.js selected. That allows us to use the processing code as opposed to a new version that's just come up. All right, once I have that, then I can actually run the program. So this is where the actual program itself runs. So in the predator-prey program, it shows the predators, the prey, they're represented as little dots, and then you have your graph down here at the bottom that shows the current state of the populations in real time. And this alters as it goes. If you want to change the settings on this, you switch back to the code view. And up at the top are where all of the different settings are for your initial run. So here is the number of predators and prey, the speed that they move at, how often the prey basically gives birth to another one. This is asexual reproduction, by the way. Predator's birth, how long it takes for the predators to die from hunger, and then there's a prey population cap. Also, there's a threshold for how far away you, for the prey to be killed by the predators, and is how often you sample for your plot points on your graph. So if I wanted to change this, I could start with 4,000 prey, and then rerun it. And now we started with a lot more prey. 